Hi, and welcome back to Vitral Design. In the 60s, the space race grabbed headlines from any news outlet worldwide. It wasn't just a technological race, it was an actual political arena in which two superpowers, back then the USA and USSR, confronted each other. Great things, great achievements happened. I would say until the late 80s. And then slowly the lights faded away and also the public's attention faded away. In 2002 though, a company named SpaceX was founded. And among its very many merits, uh, it has given a great contribution to a change of meaning to the concept of space race. Turn it, space race, turning space into a business arena, no longer just a political one. Many technological achievements have been reached by SpaceX since then. But first of all, and I'm also going to try to keep it quite simple, it gave a huge contribution to the reduction of the cost per kilo of load transported into space. A huge decrease in such value. And this has given a big boost into what I just mentioned, this business-like approach to space. And since then, many other players, Blue Origin, Virgin Galactic, just to name a couple with different agendas, on top of new nations from China to India, not to mention ESA, the European Space Agency, probably never as active as it is today. So much interest is now poured into space. But have you considered how close is space today to your business? Do you still think it's too far? Well, let me try and make you change your mind. Yes, as we speak, there's a rover traveling to Mars. It took off on the 30th of July and it will reach Mars in late February 2021. And did you know that in four years we have planned, we being humankind, of, not us, V12 Design, we have planned to go back to the moon? But these are just two pinnacles of a really huge range of activities that now are being invested towards space. We are in the years of the so-called nano-satellite revolution. Hundreds and hundreds of small and relatively inexpensive satellites are getting installed, as we speak, for numerous business applications, from improved data mapping, improved meteorology, uh, crop control, uh, logistics, all sorts of areas that will generate revenues. But even closer to us, and even us here at Vitual Design are actually actively looking into this sector, I would be really thrilled if you could look into what's going on into space, which is no longer just a scientific frontier, and to think about how many materials, processes, services will need to be adapted, designed, redesigned to work in space. And this is going to happen in the next five to ten years, not 50 years. And this will happen along two main trajectories. What is developed in, on Earth used to work on Earth and needs to be adapted and rethought to work in space. And what has been brought to life to fulfill a need in space and needs to find a new use here back on Earth. An incredible amount of simple ideas and incredible ideas of simple technologies and insane technologies. So my advice for this weekly Sparks is please don't think of the space as something far from you. Yes, maybe geometrically far from you and your business, but trust me, start looking into space because it's actually the new frontier of business. Until then, see you next time.